The Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has uh, wrapped up his uh, three-day visit to India. During his uh, trip, several high-value agreements were reached. Tao Yuan has more. A sweeping tally of agreements following talks in New Delhi, including a multi-billion dollar high-speed train, defense technology, and notably, a plan for civil nuclear cooperation. This time we've reached agreement in principle, which will provide the overall foundation for Japan-India cooperation on nuclear energy for peaceful uses. The deal is expected to be signed once technical details have been finalized. It would give Japanese nuclear technology companies such as Toshiba and Hitachi access to India's fast-growing market. Japan has in the past shunned nuclear cooperation with India, which has not ratified the International Non-Proliferation Treaty. The memorandum we signed on civil nuclear energy cooperation is more than just an agreement for commerce and clean energy. It is signing symbol of a new level of mutual confidence and strategic partnership in the cause of peaceful and secure world. Abe said Japan's cooperation with India in the nuclear field would be limited to peaceful objectives. India hopes to increase its nuclear capacity by more than 13 times by 2032. But defense experts are questioning the safety aspects of the agreement. There is a quite a broad deal for nuclear energy. But Japan itself has suffered from nuclear energy uh, leaking, uh, both in a bigger disaster linked with the tsunami and even a technician in one of the laboratories. Uh, which looked at nuclear power, uh, he died of uh, uh, radioactive poisoning. So how safe nuclear energy is is questionable. But since the market is, is becoming smaller, Japan is selling to India. Under the defense deals announced by the two leaders, India and Japan will share technology, equipment and military information. But the long-awaited sale of Japanese aircraft was not concluded. Other deals include a high-speed bullet train between the Indian cities of Mumbai and Ahmedabad. Tokyo will provide India with a $12 billion package of financing and assistance for the train, which reportedly will slash travel time from eight hours to about two hours. Taoyuan, CCTV, 